Right now at 11, packing up, people living under viaducts at Lakeshore Drive are gathering their belongings as the city says it's time to move. Good morning, everyone. I'm Erin Kennedy. And I'm Roseanne Teus. Marissa Bailey has the day off. CBS 2's Mike Puccinelli is live in Uptown now. He has more on why they're being forced out and also their reaction. Mike, what are you hearing? Hi. Well, they are being forced out to make way for bike lanes. Behind me right now, you can see the Wilson Avenue Viaduct under Lakeshore Drive. No one is there right now. That's because they have essentially moved across the street. You can see a lot of police over there right now. And as we pan to the right, you can see where the tent the new tent city has been set up here, but a lot of police officers here, and we've been told by representatives with the People's Law Center that these folks have been ordered to take down their tents right about now, or they're going to be forcibly taken down by the city. We're going to roll some video right now taken earlier this morning when they broke down their tents and prepared to move out. That after a judge last week cleared the way for the city to close down the encampment under Wilson Avenue and also another one at Lawrence Avenue in order to make way for construction. So shortly after 7 o'clock this morning, streets and sanitation crews came in and disposed of whatever had been left behind by the few dozen homeless people who'd been living under Lakeshore Drive. Now there was a heavy police presence to ensure that the forced removal of the homeless residents remained peaceful, but the police weren't needed as all of the homeless people people packed up and willingly left the viaducts. Our opinion is either give us housing or they should leave us alone and let us live our lives. They get to live their lives, give us housing or leave us alone. Basically, DFSS um, is here along with a few of our um, nonprofit partners engaging the homeless, offering them shelter or other alternatives, um, hoping that they accept services so that we can get them into a safer environment. And right now you are looking at Wilson right next, just a little bit west of Lakeshore Drive where the police have formed a line next to this line of tents here. Again, we're told that these tents are going to have to be taken down shortly or police will forcibly remove the tents and dispose of them. We have representatives here from the National Lawyers Guild, also from the People's Law Office. This could get to be a rather tense situation. We'll have to wait and see what happens in the next hour or so. Reporting live in Uptown, Mike Puccinelli, CBS2 News. Now back to you. Yes, it certainly sounds like the, like the potential is there for it to be very tense. All right, Mike, thank you.